ASU men's hockey was on a bye week this past weekend, but will soon travel to Houghton, Michigan to square off against the Michigan Tech Huskies. In studio with us today is Devils in Detail hockey analyst Josh Schaefer, who's going to help us get our bearings straight on the upcoming matchup. Josh, glad to have you in. And you know, as they say, let's do that hockey. Face USC and UCLA. And it looked like the transition from Wells Fargo Arena to the Galen Center to UCLA's Poly Pavilion may have been too much for this young Sun Devil team. Here. Of course. Herm Edwards. How could we forget about him? The man, the myth, the legend. Coach Edwards and his recruiting staff were very successful in signing 11 of the nation's top recruits on National Signing Day last Wednesday. According to 24-7 Sports, Herm and the Sun Devils now hold the sixth best recruiting class in the Pac-12. Kevin Sumlin in Arizona ranked at 11. So our next segment is going to help you get a little familiar with some of the future faces in Tempe. Here is our top recruits. It is time to officially introduce one of our newest segments here at Devils in Detail the Devils in Detail Athlete of the Week. The Sun Devil athlete who contributes the most to their team, whether it's on the field, court, mat, or track, or in the pool, will receive the award. Pretty self-explanatory, right? Well, without further ado, the inaugural Sun Devil Athlete of the Week goes to Miss Bente Roja of the number six ranked women's water polo team. Butler is one of the six linebackers that signed to ASU already. And Killian, more is more when it comes to talented linebackers because now may be the worst time for ASU to be struggling as they will play the, the Arizona Wildcats not once, but twice this weekend, Friday in Tempe and Sunday in Tucson. For continuous coverage of the Arizona State women's basketball team, go online to devilsindetail.com. ASU will play Michigan Tech this Friday and Saturday with puck drop listed at officially 4.07 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. Josh, great stuff as always. Thank you for your insight. For all of his output on the Arizona State men's hockey team, you can follow him on Twitter at Josh Schaefer 25 or you can, of course, go online to devilsindetail.com. The newly reinstated men's tennis squad got, their, got the program's first wins of the season as they hosted Loyola Marymount, Fresno State, and Cal Poly at the ASU Tennis Invitational. Our very own Carson Field was at Whiteman Tennis Center to break down all the action. As hockey is nearing the end of their season, the ASU softball team began theirs this past weekend, going 5-1 in the annual Kajakawa Classic. Our very own Matt Stalboff has the full weekend recap. 